Right. It is starting time. Wearing my fancy new hat I got from TwitchCon as well. So we've got Kanehurst to do today. And I quite like this place. As deadly as it is as points, it just looks really cool. But it's a great big gothic cast. So we got I can't remember if there's anything fun in here. You know there's like a few hidden items and stuff, but I can't remember what they are. Blood. Oh, they're the weird tick enemies. I hate those things. Like, just because of the way they move, they're awkward to fight. Hi, Dave. What are you doing? I was just saying I dislike fighting these things because they're they're awkward. But if you can get behind them, you can usually do all right. But actually getting behind them is usually the hard part. If you can hit the like blood sack, I'm gonna call it, you a decent amount of damage to them, but it's getting to the position where you can actually hit it. I'm gonna do a stupid tongue lashing thing which reaches out. Him in the sack. Yeah, that's what we need to do. Um, tell you what, I am gonna miss from my previous playthrough. Though. The gargoyles in in this place get wrecked by arcane attacks. And at this point, I could just pip them with a couple of spells and knock them flying. I'm not going to be able to do that this playthrough. But I could still lay into them because the saw spear that we're using is pretty good for pretty much everything like that. Oh yeah, this is where these little fuckers are. Remember Mikalash, the dude with the cage on his head? He shows off a couple of them. Hi, Alex. I'm alright. Yeah, he's the, the teacher guy. He's one of the few people in the game who, like, actually shows off the spells. Like, some of the enemies, the human enemies, have spells, and you can fight them without ever seeing them use them. But the spells in this game are pretty cool. They do a shit ton of damage as well, and they're mainly cheap. 
Like they cost bullets, but some of them you get two, maybe three hits per bullet. I think the most expensive one is eight bullets, which is the one that does all the the little stars that come out of your head and fly everywhere. I think that's like eight bullets. But it does a silly amount of damage if you manage to hit it with each one of the shots. Right. So we've got the cleaners. And there are ghosts in here. I can't remember when they show up. Is it just when you get it within a range? You can hear them crying and giggling and shit. So there's another cleaner. Sounds like it should be right next to me, but it's not. There they are. They were waiting until I went past. There's another one down that way. Hey, you. Right. What else was in here apart from more of you? There's another cleaner there. This place has some of the cooler weapons as well. Like there's a sword here that I used. First time I played through the game. Like I did a big strong like heavy weapons build, but there was a sword you can get in here that I used for quite a while. <laughs> Just because it looked cool. It's this sword. Right or Palash. I don't have stats for it at the moment, but it's a rapier with a gun on it. <gasps> so you ranked object. Wow. Getting Adam to carry you through ranked as well as casual games as well now. Take out all these ghosts anyway because if we don't they'll follow us even while we're exploring. So take you down. Apparently the backstab ghosts. It was unexpected. You dead. Can't hear any more noises at the moment. Apart from in that way, so check the other side of the stairs. Anything here? More ghosts. Don't want to get caught in between two of them. Like their stab attack does a fair bit. Although I'm not across near the screaming yet. 
if everything in Bloodborne has to scream you so bad. Cinematic kick off the balcony as well. Chunk! You are good for upgrades. Chunk's what we need. Might be able to almost max out the weapon from here. If we get enough chunks. So once we've gone here, I think we'll try the the nightmares as well. Where are they in here? I'm not going to go down the middle because that's like obviously where they want you to go. Make a few traps. So there's one. Here there's a one past. Two, three, four, five. Right. Are you. Sixth. You can get their knife as well. I think it's a rare drop. That's another thing I keep forgetting about as well. While an enemy is in their death animation, you can carry on winging at them to do more damage. Get more health back. We got the dress. Right, and we're outside. Great big gothic looking castle all over this place. I am one of those people, if I ever had a stupid amount of money, I would probably buy a castle. Uh, I hear flappy thing, it's a gargoyle. Backstab. Backstab will be the order of the day for these fuckers. And you're like quite obviously one. I throw a pebble at you when you come down. Ooh. Yes, you will. Bloodstone. And a chunk. Hide for We are doing the big scary castle area. How are you doing today? Ah! There you are. I am trying to remember where all the gargoyles are so they don't all make me jump. Another twin bloodstone shards. Could do with more chunks, please, but I think the chunks are all like item pickups here. This guy uses the writer palash. Ooh, you got your piercings back. Cool. Right. There you go, there's the. what the writer palash looks like. It's a rapier with a gun in it. I do not actually have any piercings. Well, I've got tattoos and stuff, but piercing is one of the things I never actually got done. Throw a rock at him. Oh 
yeah, they've got that stupid sonic attack, don't they? the second one off. <laughs> yeah, I can. Oh, this is the one with the screamers, isn't it? It looks familiar now. Right, we'll grab this first. Hi, Boz. How are you doing? We've got the viable register, which is like the PvP thing. Let's see who's on here. Yeah. So this is shortcut. <gasps> Finished straight and getting all the pro trophies. Cool. Yeah, I saw a thing saying, like, it doesn't take that long to get all the trophies. It's like 10 hours playtime to 100% it, get everything. Like, I'm about halfway through the game at the moment. I've been playing it. Since they added it to the PlayStation Extra thing. more Connell's meets makes us take more damage if I remember right. And it sends them into a bit of a frenzy. So they'll have calmed down a little bit now. Oh no, never mind. Good thing that was a breakable chair. Kill this the fast dead. He's the one that keeps marking us. Oh, let me target him. No, I need to get away. This is done. You dealt with right. Now that my mark is gone, I'll come down a bit. And I can take my time in murdering them. <laughs> yeah, you said you, you've put aside, like, how many hours to play the game, Alex? But I reckon you'll finish it in about five hours, if that. Right, um... Nothing there. <laughs> Boz is about to, to uh, 
lose his biggest advocate of all. Hi Spike. Spike is officially the I first am person first here. Puck. You you little shit. Come here. I remember right, there are, well there is, one of the little upgrade books around here somewhere. here. So there's the broken window. Yeah, I do like the puzzles in straight. But they're proper um, Think about your environment puzzles. Right, so that's the ladder we need to get to. Do we just go out the window now? I think we can pick this up for a start. See Findor. Where do we go from here? You can hear crying. One of those women. Go down this way. Grab this. Down. This way. So that's where we went earlier. Yeah, that's the dead gargoyle. So we want to go this way. And I hear another gargoyle. Yes, I do. I do think Stray is more of a, it is a puzzle game, but it's, what's the sound for, is it like environmental puzzles or whatever it is people call them? Right, do I go that way? Don't think I do, but, oh good faith would be spent. Right, I'm going to check in here. There are screamy ladies in here. There is. This lot for as well. Right, this will scream as a trap. Need to get out. Let me out. Oh, she had like a backstab animation. You gonna follow me? Please. Just a 
closest one is the screamer. She's gonna rush us, so. Trapped. No, let me go, let me go, let me go. Joined us at one of the more shouty areas. Any more around here? None of them following us, so I assume not. It's loot. Executioner's gloves. That's one of the spells. It's a really good spell as well. It summons like little skulls that fly out and hit stuff. And they do a lot of damage. Tracking on them isn't very good though, so you've got to kind of be close to use it. But worth using. So we've got the knight's gear. What's this say? Putting lights ahead, yeah. So there's another ghost down. This way, the seer there. Another screamer. Ah, just in the edge of it. Ooh, long form does a lot more damage. Oh, what's that smell? <sighs> the sweet blood. Anonymous gifted Brina underscore a subscription. An anonymous user gifted a tier one sub to Brina underscore. Thank you, Anonymanu, for gifting a sub to Brina. Brina, enjoy your ad free viewing and emotes and other perks that I always forget. So, we go in here. It's like a lever or something. I remember there being a lever somewhere that I had to pull. It's like a sliding thing. Is it around here? Maybe. Or not. Buzz. Just a loot room, then, is it? Looks like it. Right, we'll see where this leads then. Up the roof. Along here. There. So we've got that. Good night, I'm over here. Which is 1000% a trap. Any gargoyles? Oh no, there's one right there, isn't it? I'm blind. Let me throw a rock at you. There. Now is the one behind. Ah, oh, no, there isn't. Ooh, more blood. <laughs> Now we're going to go in this door. Ah, this is where you open up the the special area. So you move out, and that gives us the ladder that goes upwards. 
Ah, so you can just like run through this bit straight to the ladder. Cool. Up we go. So stairs upwards seem like obvious way forwards. I think this is where the upgrade bugs are. Down the end of here. Is it this way? Is it a bloodstorm where it's ahead? Yes. So there is an upgrade bug down here. Just gonna spot him. Where you at, you little fucker? There. Give me them chunks. Uh, no, we've been past the bit with the spider, Brina. We have killed Rum. Rum the vacuous spider is dead. This is Kanehurst. This is the castle with all the weird knights and stuff. <laughs> Wet nurse is a fun one. Uh, there is a thing I want to try at Wet Nurse. Like, nobody's sure whether it's a bug or whether it's meant to happen. But I want to try it to see if it works. So. Fargoyle. Okay, Greg, hello. Nice wig. And now we have another gargoyle, or two. No screen, please. I'm doing the run. Yeah, that wave was just for you, Greg. Just for you. Right, um. Yeah, I got 64,000 on me. Don't really want to fall or anything with all these. I don't want to top up on. heals before the boss just in case and so I'm hoping hoping there is a <laughs> Greg will probably win as well I've seen how tall he is He is at least two mods tall. Two mods or like one and a half manus. Right, they've given me a bold hunter's mark, so that means there is not a lamp before this boss. I got 14. 14 heals. Bugger it, we'll give it a go. This boss is a tough one, but we'll top up and see. Um, anything that'll be useful against him. Don't think either of those will work. Bone arrow, no, 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 no. Right, we'll stick. Beast bug pellets useful. So. 
If I don't get him, I can at least come back with full healing. Boss fight! This is one of the other few NPCs that you see use spells. And he's got cool spells. Now, I know there is a bunch of places where I can parry this guy. I've just got to remember where. I can get a decent amount of parries in, I can get a decent amount of damage in. Hello, my friend. So you got that thing. It's the big one that swirls round. You gonna swing at me? No. There he goes. Didn't get the boss though. So he does have big swings. I need to get him earlier. And watch out for that. Ooh, he's gonna dodge one as well. Mom. Oh, I'll swing at me like a normal boss. Stamina. Too slow again. Big explosion, run away. sword. Right now is where we got the beast. Because we want to get this broken. He's got some sort of bullet protection on. It's that. You don't usually use your sword thing this much. He's got bullet protection. Not fair. Right, last heal. Not bad, got him under half. So, I'm to come back with full heals and everything. Take Z shortcut. Luckily, I can just like 
run all the way there now. Or I should be able to. And do it with full heals. So we go left and run for the ladder. Yes. Go this way. There we go. Put the blade out on the weapon. Oh, his, um, his scythe blade. So I basically just need to beat on him more for it to go. Right, I'll try and get some parries in phase one. Make it a bit easier on myself. I need to parry earlier with that big swing he does though. I keep doing it too late. Getting the parry when he hits me. Here we go, full heals, full bullets. Bumps and beast wood. Same again. I didn't know that one tracked. Got him. There we go. Second try. So, 
grab me this item. Crane of Illusions. And we should be back in a second. I want to go and bank these souls. Yeah, we'll call that first proper try. Right. First of all, same as everything. Fuck you, German. Um, anything cool in the bath? We got... No, no, so... How many of these have we got? We got... 10 held, 9 stored. We need more bolt papers, so... Stock up on bolt paper. Um, yep. Do an upgrade for that. Um, save for more chunks. And we'll put a writer palash away so I don't accidentally upgrade it. Same for Evelyn. Evelyn's like a full-on haunting rifle. So. Yep, you're upgraded. We're saving the chunks to upgrade the saw spear again, so... I'm not going to use that, so we'll level up. Welcome, what is it? Farewell, uh, good mate. I should check, actually. Scaling. Ah. Skill scaling still, see. Welcome, what is it? Very well, let me... So. One, two, three. That'll give some more Farewell, damage. And then... Rest on vials. And bullets. So now we always have plenty of vials and bullets. Got 136 stashed. 125. And then you can, like, buy pebbles and shit. Now we need to head back to Kenhurst because we have something to do. <gasps> F-22 Raptor. Right, I will make a note of it for you, Brina. And I will try and get that video done over the weekend for you. So Brina. Megami. F-22. Raptor. There you go. I got it written down so I remember. I'm sure Kelly will remind me as well. I'll try to get that done over the weekend. Uh, Lugarius' seat. Where we were going? Uh, some are, some aren't. Depends upon the plane. Like the last one I did you, the uh, A380 or whatever it was. Like that one was tough. It took a while to get the actual shape of it right, like the the nose on and everything on it. That was the plane that I caught to Amsterdam as well, the kind of plane. Oh, I need to put the crown on. Got to. We got a crown, boys. <laughs> you can change it if you want, if you want an SR-71 instead. See the hidden bit. Yeah. We'll put which hat should I put on? I'll stick with the normal hunter hat because I like it. Because it reminds me of a 
Brotherhood of the Wolf, and I loved that film. Yeah, I'll leave it as an F22 for now then, Brina. You can save up more points if you want an uh, SR-71 as well. This is the Queen of the Vilebloods. She's not a nice person. So what we're going to do... I'm going to take this. The unopened summons. I'm going to light this. And I'm going to go and find a friend. I've just got to remember where he is. I think he's still at Cathedral Ward. Exams in two weeks. Oh no. Uh, so we want Cathedral Ward. Oh yeah, I should see if the lady's still having her baby. I can't remember how far along the quest is now. Hunter pistol. There she is. She is not well. Oh, there's something wrong with me. Oh. 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 Right, we'll be back to speak to her shortly. Speak to the old lady. Yeah, the old lady's giving us drugs. Set of tips. Nice. Ah, you at last see through your deceit. I did not learn from books. No, I learned it all. Oh, that guy's just spouting nonsense again. Right, where was... Oh yeah, you guys are out now, aren't you? Uh, you. It's this way we need to go. Do I not have pause jam? I thought I did. Or do I have it on 7 TV I think? Can I remember? Right. Are you out here? You should be. You are. Right, we'll give this guy uh, an invitation to Kanehurst. Oh, good to see you safe. Now, let's think up something to discuss. Just tell me what piques your interest. Dude, look, I found you this invite to Kanehurst. <laughs> Is that... Sigil of Kanehurst. I've heard tell of Kanehurst nobles and their amusingly pompous invitations. Wonderful. I thank you profusely. I will depart immediately, but first, a token of my gratitude. We're going to do a shout out for Brina. We'll see what uh stupid clip is going to pop up for him. Bum, 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 bum. Not sure no, it's Wayne wants to get over his dead wife and then be good. That's in the cold. Yeah, that's Did what, Sherry? Oh, I thought this might be the pervert clip. One server, not. Sherry. I've been 
Boo, try again. You just overlap. Just call it if they are stacked. Hey, I'm in this clip. Quick life easier. With a traditional Breener nice view spot. from the floor. Stood in the right place, but I got blasted by the beam. <gasps> Uh, yeah, Brina, it is my, uh, it is my party mug. I still have it. <laughs> oh, right. Real Hunter badge. He's giving us that. Uh, giving us the bow. I feel my master's hand at work. I was in the right place, I still got blasted by the beam. And let us You're in the wrong place then, weren't you? Tarnished streets. It has been an honour, but I must say goodbye. Let us cleanse these tarnished streets, and may the good blood guide your way. Right, so what we're going to do now... We don't want that one, we want the bold hunter's mark, or is it this one? Now we're gonna head back to Kanehurst and watch what happens. So She's still not well. So back to Hunter's Dream. Then back to Kanehurst. Sorry, Brina, most people are crap at WoW. It is just a thing. Which one had Kanehurst? Is it this one? There you go. Vile Blood Queen's Chamber. Now we get to see the fun bit. He's a bit nuts. Check out that weapon he's got as well, just covered in gore. He's basically wielding like a the wheel of a carriage or something. So Queen of the Vile Bloods, a lady who's apparently immortal, was sat on that chair. So I went and got an invitation to Kanehurst and gave it to this guy. And he just showed up and splattered her. But she's immortal, so you can kind of still see her moving a bit on the chair. I've done it. I have. <laughs> yeah, they're called the Vile Bloods because they, like, did some sort of heretical ceremony or something like that. And he's a religious nut, so he hates her. So as soon as I let him in here, he came over and just, like, splattered her. Oh look, I've got a bit of her. But yeah, she's immortal, so it's still moving. I wonder if I can get the close-up camera to work. Yeah, you can see it twitchy in there still. Because she is immortal. She's just in chunks now. And I have my own chunk. Where is it? It's in key items. There it is. What remains of Annalise, Blood Queen of Kanehurst? Pinkish lump of flesh remains warm as if cursed. All hail the undying Queen of Blood. Thank you. Yeah, pretty much. 
like she can't actually be killed so he's just gone the whole route of well if you can't die i'm just gonna pound you into small places that way you can't cause trouble so now we've done Kanehurst. i think it's nightmare time so where's the first one first one is near the grand cathedral isn't it into the pvp area where there is also lots of po lots of poison because miyazaki does love them poison swamps he's admitted it it was in an interview and everything so i don't expect there to ever be a souls game without one Right, it's this way. Oh yeah, we got the cool purple sky and everything now. I do love this effect on the sky. It's like, we get this kind of effect at sunset sometimes around here. Around the right, so we go down this way. Hunters are dead, so that's fine. Remember to go up this way because the snatcher's up here. In the snatchers. Is he gone? <gasps> He's gone. I did not know he disappeared. Right. Let's get these guys then. attacks got this one All right and then you've got another friend and if I remember right I've got to let this one grab me it is here If I just, or do I have to walk forwards a bit? Oh, the baby's cries have started. It is very faint. Right. Here maybe? Closer? About here. Or maybe I do actually have to stand right at the door. Come on, get me. Take me to the fun land. Hello. Oh, Amidala. Oh, Amidala. <laughs> Have mercy on the poor bastard. <laughs> Make a lash time. Can't get in here yet. <laughs> what a joy it is to behold the divine. It must be such a pleasure. You're in my debt, you know. You're nigh on a beast of the field. But here you are, treading a measure with the gods. <laughs> That there is Patches. Patches, who was also in every FromSoft game ever. Like, I found out he originated in Armored Core. Like, one of the missions in Armored Core, you're fighting for a faction. 
and Patches is basically a mercenary fighting by your side and he turns on you. Turns his mech and starts shooting you. We are in the lab. Anything cool? No? Patches is a dick. But he's also a coward, so if you beat his ass... Oh! It's these guys. If you got your turkey. So the theater key is gonna open another door. Anything else? Nope. Oh, nothing there. Got this corner room. It's bearing to me more of them in here, isn't it? Yep, I can see you hiding on the roof. My man's knowledge, my man's knowledge. We've got shit tons of that stuff now. We'll just pile it all on later. Get loads of upgrades and stuff. What's in here? Nothing there, nothing there. Chest! And in here we have red jelly. More uh, chalice dungeon stuff. Anything else this way? This door. Like your theatre key. Hey, there's a bunch of you. Come on. Do it the old fashioned way. This is also a good place to farm the uh, vials if you have a long putting on him. You can just trap them in the doorway like this beat on them. Although this bit is so much easier with spells. You can just drop like a mist spell right there and kill all of them as they come through. You can even see the frame rate like freaking out a bit. Hey we got a bunch of bullets. Right what's in here? Anything good? And another door at that end. And these two. Obviously not paying attention. More bullets. That's a lot of bullets. That's like 12 bullets just from killing those. And in here we have... Treasure. What is it? What is it? What is it? Augur of Abritus. It's an other spell. That's a really cool one. It lets you shoot tentacles out your hand. But no arcane in this run, so I can't show it yet. Unless one of the enemies does it later. And now, actual nightmare time. Tentacles. Yeah, it is. There's a couple of really good tentacle spells. One of them is Augur of Abritus. And then the other one is an actual weapon that you get, but you can only use it if you've got, like, a silly amount of arcane. Now, this is a PvP area. That's where we need to get to down there. It's a long way to go. <laughs> Mr. Bug. Oh well, I'll tell you what, we'll go and dump some of this insight because I don't want to run around here with too much insight. No. Let's go this 
this way. Uh, no. Spend it on these. What about you? Have I got enough for a level? Well, what is it you just very well? I do not. So keep to the mantra. Ah, this one is Nightmare. Nightmare Frontier. So yeah, what I was saying is this is PvP zone. It's one of those most games by FromSoft have one. It's an area where you go through and people are automatically called in to invade you. As long as you're playing online. So, you may actually get invaded by something. It happened in my last playthrough, so might happen again. Oh yeah, this has the freaky silver beasts in it as well. These guys are ugly. This is another one of those zones where I always get lost. I can never remember where I'm supposed to be going. Right, you're the shortcut elevator, I think. I know there is a shortcut right at the beginning somewhere. I think this is it. Lead elixir. That's really good if you... Yeah, this is the shortcut elevator. Yeah, lead elixir is really good if you're going with a heavy weapons build. It stops you getting staggered and reduces some of the damage you take so you can literally tank your way through stuff if you want to over here in there another silver beast down there get it before you can wake up properly there's another one running at me Well, big upgrade, boy. Twimble stone shards, three of them. That's decent. Now, the trick for navigating this place is these little lanterns here. This little dude will uh, show you where to go. Bell is ringing, but there's no invasion message yet, so I am good for now. For now. There are NPC invaders here as well, if I remember correctly. Bell ringing woman's around here somewhere. Oh, there he is. Ah, he doesn't do too much. Friend. Ooh, you got a whistle. Yeah, I have enough upgrades I can just tank my way through the one fine. Just be wary of any players showing up. Another upgrade bug. Up or path down. There's the bell ringing woman. She's the one who needs murdering to stop invasions. So I'm assuming we go this way. We got another silver beast. Ooh, you're one of the electric ones. Blue lantern means we're vaguely heading in the right direction. Another upgrade bug. 
Oh, giants. Don't want to get caught out by giants. So this is progress because there's a blue lantern here. So we're going to explore this way. But I am going to take the path up first. And see if the path up leads to... So I saw some, gi some giants in the distance there on the cliff. I'm hoping this leads up to them. Make it easier to uh, explore if I kill them first. Or maybe it just leads up to this. Who knew? So, this is the bit we don't like. Poison. Holes of poison. Can I get to the bell ringing room from here? Can. Bye bye. No more invasions. Not until we reach a later part, anyway. And we have these old cookers. All like to spit poison. Yeah, I do not like this place either, Alex. Just all the poison and all the giants. And slow movement, because why not? Uh, better equip my antidotes. I don't got nine. Which probably last a decent amount of time, just... Yeah, it's slow poison. I just want to get around to the giants first, because they annoy me. I'm guessing. Get me there. Oh, the giants can get poisoned. Good. Oh, the, um, the ones that do frenzy when they look at you. Or the ones that, like, grabbed your brain and tried to eat it. Yeah, the ones that try to eat your brain are a pain. Like they're resistant to pretty much everything other than piercing damage. And that spell that they have is horrible. It just traps you in place. And it's really hard to avoid. So yeah, they they like they do that thing they throw at you. It traps you in place, they eat some of your brain, everything else nearby hits you, and then they just repeat that. Oh, it traps 
What have you got? I've pulled you, that's all. Nothing interesting. Great bug on it. Get back here. Again. And a giant throwing stuff at me, apparently. Oh, he's literally just there. Yes. More antidotes. So, I bet you the way up to him is through this cave. Going this way. I know the actual way forwards is probably a great book. Come here. It's probably where we saw the giants earlier. So I'm just going to go this way and see what I can find. It is better if you can move through here locked onto something. Like your dash carries you away further. Like you can move like this. Big upgrade book. Surrounded by little ones. They're back here all of you. I just got a big one. Yeah, get some health back up. It hits me too much. Oh, you can build up fast and slow poison at the same time. That I didn't know. Fancy flowers. These are called loot. Oh, you. You're the one that I don't like. The weird singing thing. Right. She got the grab that she got us with. Probably not in a frenzy. Are we? No, we are. Using so much healing. All this for Messenger's gift. <laughs> Messenger's gift is a spell as well, it's the disguise spell. Hello there, how are you today, Mr. Bates? <gasps> Manu the Boomer. Hello. How are you today? Are you any relation to Greg the Boomer? He's quite famous around these parts. <laughs> I'm 
so you just lead up to the lantern woman. So, where does this way lead then? So this was just, yeah, this was just upwards. I wonder, is there a double back or something? Probably is. <gasps> Hi, Maud. How are you doing? I am in mandatory poison zone and I don't like it. Using up like dozens of antidotes just trying to run through here. Right. We're on cliff edge. <laughs> Alex is struggling with his autocorrect on his phone. Oop. I thought I'd fallen then. And I still died anyway because of frenzy. <laughs> Alex's phone really doesn't like him. Right, at least we know we can sprint through most of this now. So, I think I need to kill the bell woman again, but other than that, we can just leg it. Oh no, the bell lady stays dead apparently. Can't hear her ringing, so we are good. Right, what was under here? I need to remind myself. I know one of you nerds is down here. Was this the tunnel that I forgot about? Yes! It's where I needed to look. We got giants. And another upgrade book. We'll get that first. Don't want to get hit by one of those rocks. I'm escaping to the one place that hasn't been corrupted by capitalism. Space. Space. Can I get up here? Get over here. Yes. Yay, bolt paper. Bolt paper is good. And then a convenient hiding spot. Hmm. Hmm. Suspicious. Of a beast. Need to hide from the giant rocks again. Murky gemstone. <laughs> I 
before, Greg. Nobody's told him about multi-logins. Right, where are we going? We got big upgrade bug. What is over here? This is just a little bit above. This was just for the upgrade book, wasn't it? Right, so we got a bridge to cross. Oh, shortcut. <laughs> What's over this way? Does this lead to the other stone throwing guy that I found? Looks like it does. Item. We got the great folk. <gasps> VTuber month. Oh, that's the thing I did like December last time. <gasps> Bart's redeemed it. Right. Gotta hide this. Right, Bart, which one do you want? You have a choice. <laughs> oh, yeah, it was... Um... Yeah, I did VTube a month last Christmas. I did it as like a community goal thing, didn't I? <laughs> yeah, it must just still show for... Uh... On phone or something then. Right, you're further down. And how do I get... To... I just went across a gap. So... No going back now. We got... More tentacle boys. Turn back on. I see a little bit better. Something... Ah, this is where the giant is. And I can't get to him. So we've got another rune. What else do we have? Candles. This this is just a way down. We'll go back. I think we missed something there. Wait. So, I think we opened up a shortcut. there was a shortcut here. <gasps> Oops. I'm, uh... Got to turn that on. Where is the slanty one? Get further back this way. There it is. Ignore the angry wolf things. Run up here. And then run up the... little thing that we knocked down. Ah, back across the bridge. So... There's the giant down here. And there's 
more stuff that way, I'm assuming. There. Him at least out of the way. Now what's down here? We got another rune. Clockwise metaphor metamorphosis is a good one. And then... That's the way we went before, I believe. Yeah, it is. So now we can just go ahead. We got angry giant down here because I knocked him off. Total of three damage by landing on his head. And now we can just go that way. Did not realise he could see that far. Right, this is going to be the fun bit. Taking care of the winter lanterns. Because I can't remember the best way to fight them. She might have got me. So we'll get ISF goes and we'll get the sedatives the old lady gave us. We're going past them. There. So sedatives are good against frenzy. I can't remember whether it resets it or whether it like increases immunity. What does the item say? Those who delve into arcane fall all too easily to madness and thick human blood serves to calm the frayed nerves of the inquisitive minds. And so, right, so just down it when frenzy's getting high. You out of fall. Okay. Another little upgrade bug. Come here. And he fell down. Oh, well. I can hear another lantern. Where is it? It's right, I think he fell into the swamp, so I think we're good. <laughs> oh, 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 shortcut over there. Grab the shortcut before everything else. Not you. Go this way. a fire breather. You dead. And broke it unlocked. This should take us all the way back to the start. Yeah it takes us up here doesn't it? Sweet. That's this area almost done then. A little bit exploring, a bit, little bit more exploring, and a boss to do. So down this way. You fell down. You give me bolt blood. Cool.
So we got more poison, more of these things. And in there somewhere is one of the frenzy lanterns. So we just can kill shit. Why not grab them? Come here. Missed it. Shark. Most of these are just diddy upgrades. They're not massively useful. Hunter's marks. What's on this? Let me up. Oh, I actually have to go around. Frenzy Coldwood. Poison will ruin my day fast. That man's knowledge. We got more lumen flowers. Lantern singing. That is the official voice for those things, by the way. The big bulbous things covered in eyes are called winter lanterns. Oh, the, the mushroom guy. Yeah, there's another one in here. There's two of them. There it is. Um, get behind. No, I've got to take it first on. Oh, well. Fun and games. Got you. Big silver bullets. Everything here. Oh, frenzy. Yeah, that's everything. Right, we'll nip back up to replenish our healing and shit. <laughs> and then we'll go for the boss because he's only over there. He's hiding. Oh, 
Give me that lantern. Yeah, she's hiding. She might be along later or something. Depends if she notices or not. Um, all of the dolls sat down because I've used all my insight. Go away. Right, let's have a look at these new runes we got. We got. We've got a better beast rune, so we'll equip that. Like physical, arcane, fading, fire damage. And then we've got a better version of clockwise met metamorphosis, so we'll put that on. With my weapon, you can go up to it's plus eight. And we need eight chunks to get it even higher. There we go, 35 skill. Next five goes back into health. And then... Give me some more of them vials. Uh, back to the nightmare. We've got a fun boss now. Boss time. where the safe spot is on this guy is. Pretty sure it's just in between his legs. I'm just gonna watch for him doing that stomp. Let's 
time that long. And that one. I was hoping that was a stagger when it wasn't. Oh well, I won't get the fancy finish. Oop, that's the mean attack. Got him, finally. We had another chalice. And that's Nightmare Frontier done. Do -do 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 -do. Yeah, first try. Right, so. Oh yeah, it's because I've got inside now, isn't it? So she can move around. She'll be up here next to the grave. Welcome. What is it you? Okay, enough for a level. No, oh, twenty-seven. Right, we'll use a blood thing then. Farewell, good heart. Not like we're running low on healing or anything. Uh, use this. There. Welcome. What is? Very well, let little bit more help. Welcome, what is it? Very well, let a little bit more help. Farewell, good. Oof. <laughs> Uh, so we've done that. Where do we need to go now? Don't jar beast. Forgotten where I'm supposed to go. Don't burg on where. Wooden girls. Yeah, I'll go. Um. I know the lore already, it's fine, Alex. Uh, I think... Is it Yahoo Ghoul now? I'm pretty sure it is. So I think this is when the Hypogean Jail gets the uh, meaner enemies. Seeing as we're in the dark land a bit now. Yeah, so this is this area. Yeah, I need to go through here, don't I? I'll know if I've already done this bit within like a minute. I think I have. That door's closed, so maybe not. No, I've not done this bit. Cool. We better run back a little bit then. Otherwise I'm gonna get spawned. Up here. There she is. Yeah, so this is Yahargul, the unseen village. Filled with lots of murder and crazy women summoning bells and giant 
unknowable alien monsters that fire lasers at you and shit. You got me, you got me, let me go, let me go. Bastard. Poor Alex. Oh well, I remember where I'm supposed to go now anyway. Toasty, toasty, sanity. We need to go this way first. Just chunk. And then down here. Ow! those times that don't hear good. Right, so that's the shortcut back bit. So yeah, these guys like to fire laser beams and stuff at you. Gotta be careful. Unfortunately, until I kill the bell ring people. Oh, he got me again. Right, I might be able to survive this frenzy. Yes. So he'll teleport me away. And I'll pop up here. Um, whenever 30 minutes is up, I wasn't paying attention. Um, when did Bart last send that thing? Pass now. Yeah, so it is literally just up. We can go back to camera face. So, I do show you. Hi, everybody. This dickhead down here just shooting at me constantly. I'm sorting me camera out, mate. Stop it. Right. Right, uh... before he comes back. Come here. There. <laughs> oh no, no, I think we're going to keep it as hell face now. It has been decided. Right, what else? 
nonsense that we got. That exit there, so anything up here? There it is. What are you? Another room? bell ringing woman here is she I remember this way kill the witch there sorted and now you all stay dead if I kill you Yeah, your lore is that nobody can say your name properly. Ever. If they do, you lose all your power. Upper Cathedral Key. We shall be heading there later. How did I miss that? You know what? Just kill me. <laughs> right, now is the run part. So run boys. Kill her because she sort of bothers them and makes them respawn. So as long as I kill the kill the bell in the woman, I can usually skip most of the rest. And these ones I can skip because they ain't gonna get through that door. Yeah, you do literally have a Phasmo score more than triple of anybody else I know. What is already pretty cool. <laughs> I can't actually remember what Julie's Phasmo level was. I know it was quite high. I can't remember what it was. Right, what's in this? Wow, Julius is like 2,400, that's crazy. Tiny Tinnitus, another spell that I won't get to use. should stay dead now. And that just means I need to avoid the crazy lasers. Yeah. 
chunk. Right. Come on, you two. Or three. Wow. That's a crazy level. There he goes. Laser time. specific way you're supposed to do it but I cannot remember. There we go. That was it, you waited there and then just ran. And we are back. I usually end when I get tired, whenever that turns out to be, or when I get hungry. I only need a little bit. Farewell, good may you. Welcome. What? Very well. Oh yeah, I forgot to check what new stuff. I will join you. I finish work at like 5 tomorrow. So I will be a home about half 6, 7 o'clock. So about half 7, 8 o'clock your time. That was it. Lagarius wheel as a weapon now. Oh yeah, we got his helmet as well. We can, uh, if we want to. Um. Thank you, Gavin. There we go. Fire paper. Get more vault paper. Vault paper always useful. And then back to whatever that lantern's called. We got the Arugul Chapel. Let's see. Yes, I picked correct. Didn't immediately go after this thing. Two chunks. We've got this dude right here. Now, something I always want to try. I'm not sure if it's even possible. Oh, I just pass it straight through and want to come back. I was hoping I could like throw a knife at him or something. But no, it's just a cop out. Right. We've got another bell ring. Take this guy out. Take goggles out. Go. 
bullets. Blood vials back up full. Even more blood vials. More bullets. And now we're back. Into old Yahargul, where somebody has broken this lantern because they're a dick. And then we have the toughest bit these bastards. So we got Skinny, his friend at the back over there, and I'm sure there's one of them around here. I think he patrols up and down the stairs, I can't remember. Yeah, there he is. So I'm going to double check down here first because I can't remember if anything changes. Ooh. Got to the level. You do not look very healthy. Is there anything else cool down here? usually where the witches and shit were. Got an item. More chunks. And then... <laughs> oh, you do get scared in Phasmo. I have seen you jump. <laughs> right, we've got He's just waiting there I'm going to go a bit further down See if anything's changed in this bottom bit So we've got another corrupted werewolf I say corrupted werewolf, it's just a construct really Seems it's made out of people Body. Clue. More items. <laughs> See, what you should do, Maud, is if Alex wants to jump back in Phasma. Make him stream it and make him put his jump scares back on. So you can make him jump while he plays. Because that was always fun. Right, so. You're there. Can I get a sneaky backstabbing? Because I really don't want to fight all three of you. each other. I got lucky then. Just don't want him to fire his cannon because that will ruin my day. Just leaves skinny with her claws, if I remember correctly. Here he comes. See, that claw weapon is really cool. You can actually get it, but you can only get it through chalice dungeons. It's 
so he goes two-handed now, which gives him beast mode. And gives him roar as well, but I don't think he actually uses it. There, I've got you. And I got his rune. Right, that's the toughest part of this area dealt with. Time for more explorification. So out here we have... I call them mimics, but they're not. It's like... Something in a box. But seeing as they're coming out of a box, I always call them mimics. So that way is progress. We go in this way. And you've got these weird, creepy... Ritual bodies here now as well. There a bell ringer around here? I think this is a shortcut back off. It is. And. Oh, no secret there. Oh, have I just trapped myself? I have. Oh, no, I've not. If there's a secret off this elevator, I think there is. There's not one down there, there's not an underneath thing, so. Let's go. But that. There is. Go this way. Oh, wait, hold So we on the roof. Dog. Broken dog. Another one. Yo, is Vort here? Vort is uh, putting the birds to bed, I believe. Bug. Oh, is this the shortcut that lets me skip ahead, lords? I think it might be. So we have another mutant abomination thing. It's not a tail, it's a foot. It's dead. So, another chunk. So, I believe... Remember right, this is a teleporter that lets me skip a big chunk of this area. Oh, board, we spike. Off we go. Yeah, it does. It sends me all the way over there. Here. So back in the teleporter we go. we've got boxes to kill. Mm. We need to go this way, then this way, and then this way, and we free. Wait a second, does using the teleporter reset stuff? Uh, it does. Right, I need to kill the box down here again then. Or is that dead? That's still dead apparently. So, box monster here. Oh, 
ね。You're gonna break up, aren't you? You're some sort of trap. Yep. I knew. Ow, oh, that hurt. Oh, I've got plenty of bloodstone chunks, though. Right, you spotted me. Come this way. Spot me. Uh, Evels, please. Where are they at? Yeah, animals are weird. I have a friend at work who's recently got a cat. It's like an older rescue cat. It's only been with them for like a month, two months. I and speak it's already learnt that when my mate's alarm goes off in the morning for him to get ready to work, that's when it's going to get fed. So, whenever it's, uh, his alarm goes off in the morning, he'll immediately find it next to the sink because he knows he's going to go and brush his teeth. And the moment he finishes brushing his teeth, he'll find it waiting next to his food bowl in the kitchen. Oh, you're still there. Oh, because there's a bell lady nearby. This way we go then. Anybody around here? Nope. Hi Mod. There's certain bits of it that will be loud to spike just because gunshots and things like that are really loud. with the gun. Where you at? There you are. <gasps> You'll be able to hear me fine most of the time. Oh, crazy dog. Stone chunks and somebody's still shooting at me. Just doing all the shooting. Oh, it's those things spitting at me. Is it? Yeah. Look at all that. Right, what's in here? We have. Shooting iron. things in the world that I hate more than anything and that's one racial intolerance and two the Dutch Spitting at me all the time, otherwise. Like that. 
Back, oh, no. no, we need to run away a bit. No. Not some I didn't left. Rogue Thibuma cheered X10. Remember the bits battle between Maud and Spy? I remember. <laughs> you started something now, Greg. Maud the Blobfish cheered X10. Don't make me. They're both too poor. Spike spent all of his money on buying like 12 cats and pretending he found them. More man man's knowledge. <laughs> yeah, I am also broke. Until I next get paid, which is in like three weeks. But I get a pay increase this month. Is it this month? No, next month. So I still need to wait. Eight euro, you're rich. But you could probably buy out Turkey with that much money. How can you hear the squishy sounds? Get above me. Oh, the full time streamer, yes, yes. Oh, it's you. He's not dead yet because I've not killed the bell ringing woman. He's got to be around here somewhere. So, this is the shortcut that I found earlier. About. There she is. So kill you. Bell ringing woman taken care of. Right, boss time now, I think. Uh, what do I need for this one? You're going to be fire, aren't you? So we will get. What's fire pit? Are you ready for like the goriest boss like this thing is icky you ready there's one of the cooler god like cooler bosses as well so yeah you know the big many armed thing I killed earlier all right mod so there this are is four like houses the first one is red, the second one is white, the third one is blue and the fourth one is yellow. One is on fire though. On which house does the ambulance to put out the fire? The one that's on fire, Spike. But yeah, the, the many armed thing that we fought earlier, Amygdala. Oh yeah, ambulances don't put out fires. Smart mod. There, this is the attempt to make a a man-made version of one of those many arm things. And it's literally just a load of bodies glued together. So you've got this horrible thing. Ignore him for now because hey, tiny leg, leave me alone. I'm trying to get past you. That's Alex off bones. There, 
a lot of bones, a lot of skulls, and these ladies who are boffing him so they need to die. Luckily I can kill them in one full charge, so I can just do that. Not worry about them being knocked off or anything. Poor Spike. It's alright Spike, you'll get to see the important bit of the boss fight. That one dealt with. That one dealt with. Is this all of them? Hey Brina. Are you ready? Time for the fun bit. We need to get over here. We'll look at that in a second. One hundred will do his first try. Another one hundred if he does. Cheer Dex 10, look on this, you die. Come on, fire that. You sure about that bet, Greg? Okay, trouble, listen up and listen good. So there are three fridges right. The one on the left is white, <laughs> the other one in the middle is white too, and the one on the right is also white. What does a cow drink? Water. It drinks Broke water, Spike. Okay, trouble, GG. listen up and listen good. So there are three <laughs> fridges right. The one on the left is white, the other one in the middle is white too, and the one on the right is also white. What does a cow drink? Drinks whatever the fuck I make it drink. No, honestly, my mate used to like... Lived on a dairy farm. And... Okay, in trouble. the like, listen drink up thing, they would just good. dump any old So thing. there are three fridges right. The one on the left is white, the other one in the middle is white too, and the one on the right is also white. What does a white drink? No milk. So the cuffs only get water? Oh. That's sad. Pew. I knocked it by accident. No, no, calves get a special formula because we've bred out cows so much that milk they produce is actually bad for them. Right, we're almost fully upgraded for the spear. Upgrade this a couple of times. So I need eight chunks to get my pistol to nine. And Call I need a Lex. blood rock. Uh, right, so we got beast rune. Lake. That lies. There. Um, we need to check blood gems. Let's see if we got any better ones. Ooh, physical attack up. Eighteen will take you. Any better for any better? 194, what are you? You're. Mart, me old, mild, mart, durability down. Uh, do it more because somebody might pay money for it. Then you'll be extra rich. Right. 
<laughs> so uh, we'll get. Welcome. What is it? Very well. You up to forty. You up to thirty-six. Farewell, good maid. And what we'll do <laughs> is I'll give the giant in the chalice dungeon another do. So we've made it through past the one reborn. We made it to uh, the beginning of the nightmare again. Which is like the... towards the end of the game. So we'll do some more chalice dungeons. I'll see if I can get this giant done first. Because I want to go until about 10pm. So we've got about 10 minutes. Yeah, do a lot more, you're a lazy bitch. My name is Jeff. No, it's not, it's Spike. Right. Giant time. Giant was... This way. So I've got to beat the... Destroy the blobby thing on his leg. If I can even hit it. And then... Oh, and a single hit this time. <gasps> Greg played for the long one. starts taking more damage and stuff. And I still gotta watch out for those chains. See? I can dodge his actual swing but the chains still whip round and get me. when Greg said, Manu is not the boss? Well, she took over his stream recently if you haven't heard. Also, her face was eating his stream, like literally becoming bigger <laughs> as the stream advanced. I think Greg has lost grip of reality and needs to look at it from another perspective. Say it, 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 say it. <gasps> oh, Maud wants me to say the name. So, the name of the town mod is... There you go. <laughs> no, Manu is the boss. Manu is definitely the boss. Right, uh... You can just go blood vials. The six can go on to more paper. You could say poop and it'd be live you as long as you end with go go gok. <laughs> well, if you ever want to check it, I'm sure uh, Soral has the link to the song saved. Even if you chose for it, that still makes her the boss. Right. Time for... Next level. <laughs> the 
Yeah, Spike's got a point, Greg. Even if you chose it, you uh, did put Manu in charge. That makes her the boss. Did Bart just like resend his last message or something? <laughs> yeah, of course it was Bart. We believe you. Of course we do. Archie can actually type better English than Alex. Confirmed. You're that? Oh, we're on this one. Right, I know which boss is at the end now. Shut up, Mart. Right. So we have more of these fireball fuckers. Ah, I'm close to another one. Don't want to. Let's kill this one quick. Alright, they're next to each other. I'm good. It just grabbed my head. Come on, another hit or two. Yeah, got you. Yeah, but you're gonna take that point picture at any point bar. Arcane Haze. That stuff will come in useful later. Right, uh... Good files. We've got... Dog kind of thing over there. What's this way then? We've got another... Living plant thing. Another two of them. Three of them. Fun. Out of line of sight of the other ones, I'm good. You can give your ass feedback if you want to. He 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 he. <gasps> I'll have you know my ass is lovely, Spike. feedback. <gasps> What's that smell? Man. The sweet blood. Cora man you gifted Greg the Boomer a subscription. Cora man you gifted a tier one sub to Greg the Boomer. Thank you man. Thank you man. Thank you man. Thank you man. What's that smell? The sweet blood. Cora Manu gifted Spike Travels a subscription. Cora Manu gifted a tier one sub to Spike Travels. They have given 31 you, gift subs in the channel. Thank you for gifting subs to Greg and Spike. <laughs> Boys got scammed. Oh, I 
can hear the bell lady. Where is she? Is she under here? Oh, apparently not. Mm, gifted through iPads are expensive. I know that because Kelly got ripped off because she did a... Uh, you know you can buy more than one month at once. Kelly subbed to Brina for like four months in a row. I just got ripped off because she couldn't change it. Bell ringer is down. Now we have sword man. One got a snatcher. One of this little bugger. So I'll get rid of the snatcher first because he's more of a problem. Bart, 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 Manu is spending money like water again. Wasn't she saving up for something? PLS hit her with a soft pillow. Spike. Why you grassing on Manu when she gifted you a sob? So nice of you. Swarm bars. Right, sword man. Oh, he's dead. Sweet. What we needed. What are you? You're a summon. I can ignore you then. We got more fireball things. What oh, sounds like a patrol underneath? Greg. Is it in the shape of a penguin? It better be. Right, we've got doggos. Another doggo. Bump. <laughs> Wait, Manu, are you saying Greg wants a sex doll that looks like my dad? Dinner date with Greg. Video dinner date. Right, what's over this way? I saw something over here. Got a big dog. Um, uh, one of the hunter ladies. I fought you before. I'm not that bothered. Not 
as good as the boss version. And now we have the big angry looking dogs. <laughs> what did you do, Spike? What have you broke? Right, we have this cave entrance. Where does this go? the stairs apparently. What's up here? We got more spiders. Yeah I think I know exactly which boss is at the end of this then. We got spiders. Restaurant time. What kind of restaurant are you going to, Greg? Aha, upstairs bit. Is that the tick? The tick is here. That means chance of cool things. Mexican. Mm. I will probably get something fancy on Saturday morning because even though I do in D&D in the evening with Dave and everyone, I usually meet my friend Ashley or someone uh, in the morning for like coffee or something. But we're going to a breakfast place, so I'm going to get breakfast. Oh, you're one of the gun ones. Please. Stories are not. Time is it? Right, we're past 10 o'clock, but I have unlocked the boss door, so I'm going to give the boss at least one go. If I don't kill it, we will come back to him next time, and then the next stream will be going through the fancier chalice dungeons. I just need to make a note of what order they're in. So, we opened the boss door, that's where we came in here, is there a cage down, There's usually one in these corners, no, so we've got to run down, oh yeah the boss door was right at the beginning wasn't it, it was opposite the way we went, so we need to go around in a big circle. down here, back out to the big arena area, doo -doo 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 -doo. the candle lit dinner, there you go, there's the, uh, the tick, this thing appears when you've killed like enough enemies in a chalice dungeon and it's tough but 
it has a chance of dropping like weapon gems and they can be big upgrades as well from this thing. You got anything for me? No, rubbish. Yeah, I finished Kanehurst Greg. Um, got all the way through, got to Master Lagarius. And I got him on like the uh, second attempt, I think Lagarius was. Yeah, it was. Second attempt. Right. Side path is there. Need to go and do the side path. Because that gets me the components and everything to go to the next area. Ooh! You got wrecked by a trap. Unlucky. You. I really like nuts. Someone is going to clip it. Yeah, yeah best way to deal with the snatcher guys is apparently with backstabs. When they do the range, they're like angry thing. You can get around behind them easy enough. Nuts. Um, because, like, I murdered everything, Dave. I've gone all the way through Kanehurst. I've done Nightmare Frontier. So I've killed Lagarius. I've killed Amygdala. Killed one reborn. Killed the giant from this chalice dungeon. And if I remember correctly, for where I am, did the dog fall down? He did. Let's go get him. I believe the boss at the end of this chance dungeon should be Rom. Oh yeah, the blood stays for a bit. It's not a buff, it's just because I'm laying into state laying into things. Like the type of clothing you wear affects it as well. Oh, we've got all these spiders and a fire lady. Was that her coming towards me? It was. Spiders. Sound. Oh, it's you. I need to ask you something, and I want you to be totally honest with me. It might be awkward with us after this, but I have to know how you feel. I have kept this in for the longest time, and oh, it's what? about time I was straight up and confront you about it. I hope this doesn't ruin me being in chat. I just need to know, as I can't see any other way to get over this. It doesn't seem fair to me if I don't get an answer. I want you to tell me truthfully no matter what it is. Do you know the Muffin Man? Mm. Did I get blocked or something? Or is that just like massively delayed? Because I can't see that message in chat. Hi back. I am confused. It's going to be Spike. It's definitely a Spike message. I just don't know why it didn't show up. I'll have to check uh, Twitch later and see if it shows up in the TTS redeems.
Right, what's this way? More spiders. You're actually a robin spider. Quick pause. What are we confused about? TTS went off and couldn't see the message for it. And I'm not sure why. Ah, so it's you, Boz. Mm. Yeah, I'm just not sure why the message didn't show in chat. We shall find out. Is this the treasure room? It looks like a treasure room. It is the treasure room. This is the room we needed. my health in a single swing. Like that. Come on. Open the coffin. Give me the loot. Right, I am going to need heals before doing the boss, so... We'll I need to ask here. you something and I want you to be totally honest with me. It might be awkward with us uh -huh, after no, this, but I have to know how you feel. you. I have kept this in foul the longest time and it's about time I was to wait up and just confront you about it. I hope this doesn't ruin the relationship you already have. I just need to know as I can't see any other way to get over you this. It doesn't seem fine to me if I don't get an answer. I want you to tell me the truth. Do you know the Muffin Man? Do you know the Muffin Man? The Muffin Man. Muffin Man. Right, can I sneak up on this guy? Got him. You just wanted the Uru version. There. Which more blood? Uh, anything else down here? Maybe? No? Yes? No, appears not. Other way then. Zeg can yade a mosselman a mosselman a mosselman. Zeg can yade a mosselman die wound in Skaveningen. <laughs> Shut up, Mard. Trying to work out whether that's. Dutch or German. I'm going to assume it's Dutch because Mark put it. Doesn't like there's anything in here other than this chest. No, it's, it's Dutch, because German doesn't have D-E, unless it's used as an abbreviation. Der, die, oder, das. I'm just kidding about the blob, but... Oh, I need to go... This way. I'm trying to remember my way out. is this way. Yeah it is. So boss is that way so I'm gonna nip back this way get some heals probably get another level and then do the boss. Now give him at least one attempt. About the blob but Bam, 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 bam. 
bum, bum. Egg. Ken. Yay. Da. Muscle man. Da. Muscle man. Da. Muscle man. Zeg. Ken. Yay. Da. Muscle man. Die. Wound in. Scavening on. <sighs> right. Levels. Slightly more damage. Time for the boss. See how well we do. If I die, then we will come back to this next stream and we'll do a bunch of chalice dungeons. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my spark paper on in case it is the boss that I think it is. So. Grog the Boomer cheered X10. Trouble for raid, cunt raid, trouble for raid, saving this for later. <laughs> Do you know that, Greg? There's a. Uh... Do you actually have a raid message that somebody set up for me like. yonks ago? And I just never used it. Like, I updated it recently to add my. my raid emote into it, and that's it. So I think, what was it? There. My friend Sean set that up for me. But I've never used it ever. Now, is this who I think it is? It is! Right. It's gonna be interesting. Because it's an enclosed space. Oh, I'm still doing a decent amount. Let's use it today. So many spiders. Right. He's under half, so he's going to start using spells. And the spells really hurt this time. So the spiders. They're fucked wrong. Your little tantrum. Need to stay top top because if one of those things headbots me. Gonna ruin my day. Got ya. There we go. <gasps> Bye, mod. Wait, there's another layer? I thought Rom was the end of it. This has me confused. There is a layer 4. Did not realise there was a layer 4. Ah oh, well, I know what we're doing next stream then. Shall light this. And that's me done for today. I need to go in search of food and stuff. So yeah, we've hammered through stuff today. We got what, uh, one, two, five bosses down. Yeah, we did. Three, four, five. Yeah, five bosses down. Smash through it. So we'll do more chalice dungeons next time. Welcome to stream ending. 
which means we're not actually that far off the end of the game. We've got a bunch of Chalice Dungeons to do, which I might get stuck on for a bit, don't know. Um, after the Chalice Dungeons, we got the rest of the game. So, let's find somebody to raid. See who's alert around, who's online, who is doing stuff, who isn't finishing shortly. Um, um, or if anybody has any suggestions, because my brain ain't working. Yeah, we'll go and raid on over to Iris, shall we? We've not raided Iris for a while. So, we have Fall Guys as well. So, be nice everybody. Use the nice raid message. Iris is lovely. And I will see you all soon. I'll be posting the schedule back up in Discord. But until then, bye bye everybody. No, not cunt raid, not for this one, boss. Iris is nice, be nice.